The Kenya Tourism Board is calling for strengthened partnerships with trade stakeholders and county governments that will leverage on travel trade as means of spurring tourism numbers in the country. Kenya Tourism Board Acting CEO John Chichir says tapping into travel trade will ensure tourists enjoy seamless hospitality services that have mapped out Kenya as a preferred tourist destination. The hospitality industry continues to record improved tourist arrivals as it steadily recovers from the COVID-19 pandemic aftershocks. Kenya registered a 72.4% recovery growth in the number of international visitor arrivals in 2022, which exceeded the global average recovery rate of 63%. The Kenya Tourism Board is working towards creating avenues that will showcase opportunities for market growth both domestically and internationally. One of the key things is that they are our partners as much as Kenya Tourism Board does invest in marketing uh, of Kenya domestically and internationally, the conversion is done by the trade. So we are bringing them close to have a clear understanding and clear alignment as well as agreeing on the direction in the, in the numbers that we target to achieve. He has called for integration with various government agencies that will broaden the scope of tourism within counties. With the county governments is critical because that's where most opportunities lies and working in partnership can only mean a better outcome for our country in terms of diversification. Stakeholders have affirmed their commitment to furthering the tourism industry's growth through the promotion of sustainable tourism initiatives and products to help unlock the potential of the domestic markets by building traveler confidence. We continue opening new products, we continue looking at new areas, uh, we continue uh, insisting on uh, sustainability, then we will see uh, very positive growth over the next few years. The bed occupancy of the domestic market is projected to increase by 10% during the 2023 Easter holiday. Ndusamokami for Prime Edition.